Hey there, my awesome viewers. Today, I'm going to share some of my top tips on how to generate an incredible story for your YouTube channel. Trust me, with over 10 years of experience, I've got you covered. Topic Ruby and the Dragon In the end, there will be questions about this story. You have to answer them in the comments. Alright let's start the video. Once upon a time, in a village nestled between rolling hills and blooming meadows, there lived a magical unicorn named Ruby. Ruby had a magnificent horn that shimmered in all the colors of the rainbow. She had a heart as pure as gold and a spirit as gentle as a summer breeze. In this village, everyone adored Ruby for her kind nature and her willingness to help others. One beautiful sunny day, as Ruby trotted through the village, she overheard the villagers whispering about a treacherous creature terrorizing their peaceful land. It was a fiery sharp-toothed dragon, and its flames had already caused much destruction in the neighboring villages. The villagers were scared and desperate for a hero to save them. Concerned for her friends in the village, Ruby decided to take on this brave and daring task. However, she knew she couldn't succeed alone. So, she set off to gather her animal friends from the surrounding forests. First, Ruby found a group of wise old owls and asked for their help. The owls, known for their keen listening skills, agreed instantly. Next, she came across a family of rabbits who were very good at multiplication. Ruby explained her mission, and the rabbits happily joined her. They hopped and skipped along to find more allies. Ruby and her ever-growing group soon stumbled upon a group of clever squirrels who were excellent at addition. With their excellent math skills, the squirrels agreed to aid Ruby on her noble quest. Together, they continued their journey towards the dragon's lair. As they ventured deeper into the dense forest, the unicorn and her newfound friends encountered many obstacles. But they stayed determined and remained focused on their goal. They crossed raging rivers, climbed steep mountains, and braved dark caves, always supporting and encouraging one another. Finally, they arrived at the dragon's lair, a cavern hidden behind cascading waterfalls. The tremors from the dragon's roar echoed through the walls. Ruby's heart pounded with both fear and excitement as she realized the moment had come to face the menacing fiery sharp-toothed dragon. The group quickly devised a plan. The owls would swoop down from above, distracting the dragon with their hooting sounds. In the meantime, the rabbits would perform their multiplication magic, creating illusions to confuse the beast. Lastly, the squirrels would use their superb addition skills, counting and redirecting the dragon's flames away from the village. It was a sight to behold as the owls' hoots echoed through the cave, the rabbits multiplied and dazzled the dragon, and the squirrels skillfully redirected its fiery breath. With the dragon disoriented and its flames harmlessly redirected, Ruby seized the opportunity. She summoned all her strength and charged towards the dragon, her horn glowing brighter than ever. With one powerful strike, Ruby's horn pierced through the dragon's scaly hide. The beast let out a mighty roar before collapsing to the ground, defeated. The village was saved. The villagers rejoiced, grateful for the unicorn's bravery and the amazing teamwork of all the forest animals. Ruby reminded them that the key to their success was good listening and working together. She explained how the squirrel's addition, the rabbit's multiplication, and the owl's listening skills all played an integral part in their victory. She hoped the villagers would remember this valuable lesson. From that day on, Ruby continued to spread love and kindness throughout the village, always reminding everyone of the power of good listening and working together. And whenever a problem arose, the villagers knew they could count on Ruby and her animal friends to come to their aid. And so, dear little friend, remember Ruby's tale as you drift off to sleep. May it inspire you to listen attentively, practice your addition, and always be there for others. As you close your eyes, know that Ruby and her magical friends will forever watch over your dreams. Good night, my dear friend. Reflection Questions Lightbulb
How did Ruby gather her animal friends to help her on her quest? What obstacles did Ruby and her friends encounter on their journey? What lesson did Ruby teach the villagers after defeating the dragon? If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and follow me on Instagram and YouTube for more awesome content. Thanks for watching, and until next time, keep those cameras rolling.